Hi guys, welcome to Wednesday Quickie. I'm gonna do a review of something from Brussels sprouts. Oh, those beautiful little cabbages. This is from Urban Accent, your culinary wingman. A small batch crafted gluten-free, made with natural flavors, balsamic and roasted onion, veggie roaster, seasoning blend. It comes in three pouches. So it says to use a one pound of Brussels. I have about a pound and a half, so I'm gonna have to open a second uh, pouch of this. So that's what I'm gonna do. First thing it tells you to do is melt some butter. So I'm gonna do that, or use some melted butter. I'm gonna melt my butter in the air fryer. Like, why not? Just make sure your little container is oven proof. This is a ramekin. So I'm gonna put that in the air fryer. And I'm gonna melt this for, it's not gonna take very long, probably two minutes. So I'm gonna turn the bottom on, top on it too. I'm gonna melt that, and then we'll be back. All right, so that took two minutes. Um, there's the butter. Now again, I'm not, the recipe is for one tablespoon. I'm using two because I have more than a pound of Brussels sprouts. And with olive oil, it says three tablespoons of olive oil. I'm using four, okay, and a package and a half. You just adjust it to how many you have. So there's my butter. There's my olive oil. And a packet and a half. It's pretty cool. It comes in three individual packets like this. I'm gonna smell this and see how lovely it smells. It looks really good. Let's see if I smell rosemary. Oh, yes. I smell lots of rosemary. That smells wonderful. Let's hope it tastes wonderful. So a package and a half for me, okay? There you go, that's good. And then I'm gonna use my vacuum sealer to seal this back up. You know, you gotta have vacuum sealer. It's not just for sealing or vacuum sealing. You can, you know, close up potato uh, chip bags, or cereal bags, all kinds of stuff. So mix that up pretty good. Like the way it looks, here. You know? Here's my Brussels. They've been uh, trimmed and cut in half. I'm gonna mix that in there. Okay, you can adjust uh, oven recipe to air fryer recipe. It's it's really easy. You, once you figure it out, like you'll be not so afraid to try try it all. Okay, so you don't have to really go crazy with that because we're gonna use a paddle. That DeLonghi comes with a paddle, a stirring paddle that you can take out or put in there. Where are you at? Let me zoom you up just a tad. Make sure your machine's turned off. I'm gonna put the paddle in there because I took it out for uh, to melt the butter. I'm just gonna toss that in there. And it, the air fryer is still a little warm, so it might start turning right away. It starts turning in like three minutes, okay? So don't freak out if you get an air fryer like this and you're like, the paddle does not turn, it doesn't work. It's because it has to be warm. The air fryer has to be warm for it to turn. All right, so you gotta wait about two, two let's see if it turns. Yeah, it's turning. So, uh, let's see, do I want to keep the bottom on? Yeah, I'll keep the bottom on. I'm going to do the top one at three. Don't do it at four because it's going to turn black, I'm pretty sure. So, I'll let you know how long the packet says in the oven. 350 for 25, 30 minutes. So, I'm going to check that in 15 minutes if they're good to go. I'll let you know. All right, guys, that was exactly 20 minutes. They're not the big Brussels. They're just the regular size. So, there you go. They're little Brussels. The little baby ones. I prefer the little Brussels over the big ones. I don't care which one. But there you go. Tom's going to try. He, you can hear him complaining in the back. I'm not complaining. Okay, go ahead, babe. No, you're not supposed to read what it is. Well, yes, I am. Now you know what it's... T you're going to say uh, it tastes like balsamic. It tastes like roasted onion. <laughs> roasted onion, yes. Yeah. Mmm. Balsamic. Is it tart? Is it tart a little bit? Mm -mm. Okay, so that's good. Roasted onion's good. Mm -hmm. What else do you taste? Is it salty or peppery or anything else? A little bit of garlic. Garlic. Mm -mm. Good flavor? Mm -hmm. They can't see you nodding. Yes. You keep putting stuff in your mouth mm. and then you can't talk. It's very good. <laughs> Apparently, you keep putting them in your mouth. <laughs> There's a whole point to that. 
Okay, so what do you give it a score at? Hmm. I think it was like a buck twenty nine. It, it wasn't over two bucks, but that's a no, pretty that's good, good deal. Yeah. Yeah, four seventy five. Four seventy five. Four point seven five. Mm hmm. Just to make sure. Mm -hmm. That's a good score from mm -hmm. Tom. All right. Mm -hmm. Well, there you go, guys. Thanks for shopping. Bye-bye.